Hello everyone and welcome to the new Let's Play The Stanley Parable With me is Jasper Hi there And we're back from a long time gentlemen because All of his And ladies because gone. of the well, holidays mean? obviously Stanley holidays. decided to go Happy to the Happy New Year region. everyone Perhaps Happy New Year indeed Mr. Memo. Yeah so we know all this standard stuff uh, Jasper But I heard somewhere that uh, The choice that we made last time believe it was the, the red door in when the end Stanley We can still to make another decision we can really piss him off. Left. So I will really want to do that. <laughs> <laughs> this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. We yeah, never learned. He wanted to stop no, by we the never employee learned. lounge first, just to admire it. We never do. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. Yes, yes, but, but I don't admire it at all. Business, so let's <laughs> the first open door on his left. Uh, no. <laughs> right. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't. <laughs> <laughs> I do love the narrator Look, in this Stanley, game, it, it's I still brilliant. We've gotten off on the wrong foot here. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact yes. is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Mm. There's someone you've been neglecting, Stanley. Someone Jump. you forgot. What? Yep. Really? <laughs> I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? <laughs> Are you that convinced that I want oh, something bad to happen yeah. to you? Always. Why? I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help he you. He really wants to, to help. To show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Uh, here we go. Now listen carefully. Okay. This is important. Stanley walked through the red door. Blue door. Blue. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh! Stanley walked through the red Blue door. Blue door. We'll, we'll keep being persistent. Keep the... <laughs> I still don't think we're communicating. <laughs> Stanley walked through what's, the red door. What's around? Door. Yeah. I, I sh I'm sure there's not a choice. To yeah, there we go. Yeah! Yeah. All right, fine. Go ahead. <laughs> you want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out yeah. what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. Yeah, let, well, let's see what this is. You what see? is this? There's nothing What's here. This room? I haven't even finished building this section of the map because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Broken <laughs> rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Yeah, definitely. You don't think I put a lot of time into <laughs> definitely. that? Definitely. Because I did. And in the end, it Anarchy. was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You've given me absolutely <laughs> nothing so far. Tell you what. <laughs> let me take a stab in the dark at a new design, and you can give me some feedback. There we new go. New design. A third yeah. option. This uh, already feels oh, like the of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for ah, a spin. Ceiling light. <laughs> Office space. <laughs> Exposed textures, yeah. We haven't been here. Okay, no. I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new ah. version. <laughs> Would you say that the game benefited from allowing hmm. you more choices? Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some Are you gonna be honest? feedback here. Hell no, man. <laughs> I, <laughs> I, I, I'm, I'm thinking of giving it to one to see how aggravated he gets. <laughs> a one. Yeah, one it is. A one? <laughs> I mean, I can understand if you had reservations, you saw ways the game could be improved to more fully express itself mechanically and artistically, but a one? That's not even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Uh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. Go to a Here, therapist, I don't based know. Based on the data from your previous <laughs> playthrough, I've compiled a new version. A new version, perfect again. Candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. What? What? What is this? A, a leaderboard? The Stanley Portable leaderboard. <laughs> this this has got to be fake. This this can't be right. This is just filled in shit. <laughs> but it's probably funny, so let's take a look, eh? <laughs> Skip to two seconds. Oh yeah, look, we're last. <laughs> what a surprise! Yeah, seven hours. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah, we're such good players, we are. Right? Wanna ask some friends for help? Else. <laughs> <laughs> friends list empty. You have no friends. <laughs> you don't have 
have any friends. Nobody likes you. Oh, wow. A dead rat <laughs> is better than us. <laughs> nice, nice. This is you. <laughs> this is yours. They really like to announce that you're a wank. That's what they like to do. <laughs> oh, wow. Bloody hell. Okay, then let's... Uh, Oh uh, yeah, this is just a repeat now. Yeah, let's that's a on. repeat. Let's go to that weird ass door. Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, what? honest answers, please. <laughs> Are you kidding? That, that leaderboard means absolutely nothing to me because that you know, in a single player game, I don't care about leaderboards. I don't know. So, no. No. <laughs> now we I are on I've got a prototype of a new game I've been <laughs> uh, working on and now we're trying to convert the opportunity now, to give it some play testing. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. Oh, here we go. So he's got So we're now getting a new game. In what the game, fuck is the this? Left <laughs> uh, is that a baby? Is that a baby? To move him back to the right. And if he reaches the fire, you fail. <laughs> <laughs> that is incredibly All sadistic. All the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the oh, demands well. of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. <laughs> but of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why four don't you hours? Give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective. Are you kidding Be me? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. <laughs> 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 Dude, this is this is incredibly <laughs> annoying. <laughs> this bell sound. <laughs> <laughs> Can you imagine doing this for four hours? My no. God, man. This is <laughs> <laughs> oh come on! All right, shall we just shall we just put him into the fire? Seriously, call me this yes. prick, but Jesus, there's no other decision here. Fuck it. <laughs> if you do it because you hate babies, or purely despite me, because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank oh, for, for fuck's sake. Your input was extremely no. valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? Oh, we're gonna play other games now. Yes, this seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. More babies? God, I hope not. Especially this fucking creepy buttons. What? Well, Stanley, is this any better? At last, is this Minecraft? Is this Minecraft? Is this Minecraft? Game I had absolutely nothing to do. It's Minecraft. It's Minecraft. What the hell? And of well, course, we can't this. do anything as Stanley. You can only push buttons. You. So From now on, I will only create uh, to fulfill a greater artistic purpose. Watch this, Stanley. I'm going to build a house. He's going to build a house. <laughs> what? <laughs> ah, here he is. This will <laughs> do. Here, no, here, and then. This is the crappiest house ever. <laughs> I, uh, yes, of course. And just to finish it all off, yes, it's complete. <laughs> I made this standing. Look at it. Oh, it's well, just mud. My work of it's art it's a mud house with a, with a door in it. Inadequacy. And there is a space uh, of like what one acre. Outside. You've only gotten half the experience. Not even that. Please step inside and make yourself comfortable. Fuck's sake! Seriously. Isn't it grand. Isn't it perfect? That's it could only be better if... <laughs> wait, that's it. We must rebuild it out of diamond. Diamond everything. Oh, diamonds! Yes, yes, yes. Come along, Stanley. <laughs> we have to go mining. We have to go mining? Oh, God. And why do I have to go with him if I can't do anything? That's completely oh pointless. It looks like it's going to get a bit dark. Have you brought a light? <laughs> no. No. Oh, no, 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 no. This is far more open-ended than I had in mind. I'm looking for something more narrow and linear. Something that makes you feel yeah. utterly irrelevant. This won't do at all. One out of five. Even the diamonds couldn't save this one. Okay, new game. Ah, oh, goddammit. <laughs> Another new game. New game? Yeah. 
I wonder what it's going to be now. I mean, I recognize that sound. No. <laughs> no what? fucking way. Yes. I don't it's even Portal. Know what this <laughs> <is>. <laughs> it. The first Portal. You, trapped in a glass box with no way out, listening to me talk. Oh, it's inspired. I couldn't have done it any better myself. What is this <laughs> game even supposed to be? I can't figure it out. This must be the okay, most boring no, way curious. to live ever. Let's go find out what the hell this is. Hey, can we... Hey. Nice music. Yeah, nice. <laughs> you can actually tow stuff around. This time I can actually do something with this stuff. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> what does this say? Portal sequence. How to mo indication cat. Ah, shut up. I don't care. Right, let's uh, get the hell out of here. I'm taking you with me. Yeah. <laughs> Right. Anyway. <laughs> oh, it's a puzzle. Critical thinking. A Stanley. puzzle. Your forte. Oh, this is incredibly hard to figure out. I mean, we have a block that so obviously needs to be placed there. So let's put it on with the radio. Oh, that doesn't work. Okay. <laughs> okay then. Genius. <laughs> wow. Genius. <laughs> My god. Well, let's take it with us. No, actually, you know what? I think that's plenty. I really don't care much to see you stumble through any more of these games. And I highly doubt you're any wiser for the experience. What? Which is why, rather than continue to waste my time, I'm just going to leave you here. You can pretend you've beaten the game if it makes it any richer for you, but as for me, I've had enough. Oh, God So, damn it. why don't you get cozy in this room, and if you have any grand so he revolutionary again. ideas for the perfect uh, video game, drama you queen. can just sit there yeah. and let it ball up inside you for all eternity. I don't need your advice. I think he needs some sugar on his damn you know. Uh, <laughs> I don't need your ratings. Just sprinkle it And I certainly and don't sprinkle. need the validation of a man whose job is to push buttons. I think I'll just go about my business making meaningful cultural contributions to the world. And perhaps every now and then I'll think back contributions to a man on the world. Stanley, he barely has to budget for it. Wrong in every decision I mean, he ever made. He made this it game. Last long. That Goodbye, Stanley. Makes Good me laugh. Your work. It makes me laugh. I but hope I don't that think that they continue on with after. like making more doors or more rooms or stuff like that. I hope they Can't do that. Can't get out. I think I can. I think that's our way out. Let's, let's see what the radio does. <laughs> well, that was our radio. <laughs> yeah, it's safe to it's jump It's a high there. jump. Yep, let's go. Woo! Ah! Huh. Well, this looks abandoned. Yeah, and I think our radio's gone too. <laughs> yeah, this looks incredibly abandoned. Still do the annoying clicking sound though. Seems like there's dead ends here, Jasper. So I don't know what's going on here. Can't we get out? Probably jump down. Yeah. Ah! What the hell? Uh. No idea. Oh wow. Okay, so now we're in some weird hallway that's incredibly dark. Looks like the office. <laughs> yeah. Except it's abandoned. Huh. But this feels lonely. Yeah, I wonder where this actually leads to. Oh look another door. Oh, it leads back to the same room, I think. Yeah. I'm confused. <laughs> I am. I think we um we should Oh yeah. There's light. Light and computers here. I think we can do anything with them. Alright, so now we are definitely abandoned. Oh, 427, look, that's our room. And right now it's... What the hell is all this shit? It has been changed. Yeah, definitely. Alright, so... If we walk back, what, uh, what's gonna happen? What? Ah, uh, black screen. I wonder what he found. Ah, 
If what he wanted was to be the leading man in his own story, well, perhaps he's gotten it, down in wherever he is right now. I wonder if he's happy with his choice, and if he's learned the heavy cost that comes with it. He'll understand soon what I was trying to tell him. He needs me. Someone who will wrap everything up at the end to make sense out of the chaos and the fear and the confusion. Yes, That's yes. who I am. That is what I mean to this world. Oh, yes. Yes, I'll be back <coughs> in another way. Once this ends, after it all comes to a close, then I'll be back. The end will be here soon. Very confusing. Very soon. I can wait. <laughs> So, well, now it's probably so going to restart the game. It? I think so. Hold on. Yeah, it's restarting. <laughs> Shall we try, you know, what happens if we pick up the phone? Instead of putting the wire out like we did last time. I wonder, All yeah. of this co I wonder what gone. happens. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Hold on. They look like a person. Uh, yeah, indeed. You saw that too. Huh. I swear I saw a person. You? Me too. Creepy shit. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his We this are going was not to this the way. correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Wow. Yes. yes, what a beautiful this room. <laughs> and, uh, ah. To get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Ah, uh, no. <laughs> um. Stanley was so bad at following directions, <laughs> it's incredible he wasn't five years ago. Right. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Mm. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. Let's pick up the I phone. I realize that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. My There's someone God. you've been neglecting, Stan. I wonder what this company someone actually does. Forgotten about. <laughs> Please, <laughs> me too. Stop I have trying no idea. to make every decision by Looks yourself. It's like some... I'm not asking Like a paper me. company or some shit. I'm asking yeah, paper or post. Yeah. yeah. This is it, Stanley. Your chance to redeem yourself, to put your work aside, to let her back into your life. Her. She's been waiting. Well, yeah. Let's take a look then. That's her, Stanley. You need to be the one to do this, oh, to reach out to her. her. If you can truly place your faith in another, then pick up the phone. Oh, here we go. Uh oh. Wide screen. <laughs> uh. What? The hotel room. Uh, Stanley, is that you? Uh, hold on, sweetie. Sorry to keep you waiting. What the I fuck is this? Out of the oven. All right. Okay, there we go. All right, now I want you to come in and tell me all about your day. <laughs> What the? <laughs> <laughs> gotcha. oh, come on. Oh wow. Did you actually think you had a loving wife who'd want to commit their life to you? Oh, I'm what trying a to prick. make a point oh. here, Stanley. I'm trying to get you to see something. Come inside. Let me show you what's really going on here. What a jackass. This is a very sad story about the death of a man named Stanley. Death. Press you on your keyboard. What? Oh, and I can't move there because there's a couch there. And okay, this is this is incredibly shit room. You. Stanley is quite a boring fellow. He has a job that demands nothing of him, and every button that he pushes is a reminder of the inconsequential nature of his existence. What a bastard! <laughs> Look at him there, pushing buttons. That's exactly <laughs> what he's told to do. Now he's pushing a button. Now he's eating lunch. Now he's going home. Now, he's coming back to work. One might even feel sorry for him, except that he's chosen this life. So now we have to press buttons. I don't want to press that button. God damn it, he forces me to. But in his mind, <sighs> ah, in his mind he can go on fantastic adventures. From behind his desk, Stanley dreamed of wild expeditions into the unknown. 
fantastic discoveries of new lands. Mm, new lands. It was wonderful. And each day that he returned to work was a reminder that none of it would ever happen to him. Ah, <laughs> oh, bloody hell. We have to watch TV, okay. And so he began to oh, and it turns to about his own jobs. <laughs> First, to imagine that one day while at work, he stepped up from his desk to realize that all of his co-workers, oh, his boss, everyone in the building had suddenly vanished off the face of the earth. The thought excited him terribly. Yes. To spend time with the boys. With the boys. Boys? So, he went further. He imagined that he came to two open doors and that he could go through either. At last, choice. What were these boys? It barely even mattered what uh, I don't know, know what boys. <laughs> the mere thought <laughs> boys. that his decisions would mean something was almost too wonderful oh, no. to behold. To prepare dinner. As he wandered through it just the world, <laughs> he began to fill it with many possible paths and What's destinations. The Down one path lay an enormous round room with monitors and mind controls. And down another was a yellow line that weaved in many directions. And down another was a game with a baby. <laughs> and he called it the Stanley Parable. Stanley Parable. To tell your kids a story. It was such a wonderful fantasy, and so in his head, he relived it again, and then again, and again, over and over, wishing beyond hope that it would never end, that he might always feel this free. Surely there's an answer down some new path, mustn't there be? Perhaps if he played just one more time. To tell your wife you love her, what? This doll? What? But there is no answer. <laughs> How could there possibly be? <laughs> no, In reality, disc. all he's doing is pushing the same buttons he always has. Nothing has changed. The longer he spends here, the more invested he gets. The more he forgets which life is the real one. I feel like it's slowly turning into your... Uh, yeah, room. office. Yeah. And I'm trying to tell him this. That in this world, he can never be anything but an observer. That as long as he remains here, he's slowly killing himself. But he won't mm. listen to me. He won't stop. Here, watch this. Stanley, the next time the screen asks you to push a button, do not do it. Okay. Uh, uh, I'm not going to do it. I God, I hope he doesn't force me to do it anyway, though. Regardless. Maybe I don't get a decision here. That sound of the clock with it. Yeah. That is really getting on your nerve too. Shut up. How long do we have to wait if we don't do it? I mean... <coughs> do we actually get a decision here, Jasper? I have no idea. I mean... I don't know. God, that but it's clock is clock irritating is working me. on my nerves. Yeah. I hate those type of clocks. Shut up. Right, fuck you it see, then. can he just ah! not hear me? Damn it. How can I tell him in a way that he'll understand that every second he remains here, he's electing to kill himself? How can I get you him to give see me a what decision, I see? You jackass. How can I make him look at himself? <laughs> to question nothing. What? I suppose I can't. Not <laughs> in the way I want him to. But I don't make the rules. I simply play to my intended purpose, the same as Stanley. We're not so different, I suppose. I'll try once more to convey all this to him. I'm compelled to. I must. Perhaps, well, maybe this time he'll see. Maybe, maybe this, time. this time. And I tried again. Please die! <laughs> Please die! And, again. and Stanley pushed a button. And I tried. <laughs> and it just keeps going on. And I tried again. Just Stanley pushed the button. And, ah, uh, bloody hell. <laughs> I think it's restarting again, to be honest. But I think yep. that's that's a nice conclusion for today. My god. That was weird. I've got the thing there's not much else we can do in this game, so what I'm going to do is I think uh, after this one more episode. And then we'll move on to another game. Okay then. Yes. Thank you all for watching again. Good to have you around. And see you next time. We'll see you next time. This is Senator Jasper. See you on the next episode.